Assalamu alaikum. Uh, today I will talk about how to draw uh, restrictive shadow. Uh, restrictive shadow is very important for us because we are a student uh, in architecture college. Uh, so sometimes when you design, when you design a building or or maybe small things like your books, you need to know how how the shadow reflect on this uh, drawings. Uh, in this drawings, I will use uh, different tools. Uh, I will I will use uh, different uh, sizes of pencils and uh, roller, and uh, maybe I will use eraser and uh, paper. So that's what I need in the drawings. First of all, I need paper, roller with T, eraser, and pencils. I use different sizes of pencils because uh, this, uh, when I start a uh, draw, I will draw with a light line. Uh, at uh, the finishing, I will dark it because uh, if there is a mistakes or something, I can erase it later on. So first of all, I will draw her that line. Then, in the middle, I will draw a small uh, vertical line. Here maybe. And I choose points. Choose here. And here, then connect this point with these two points in the horizontal line. This is the first. Second point. Then I will choose. I will draw a vertical line, here also a small vertical line, one here, let's choose the other here, then connect this two points, one here, and over here. Now I will connect this point with this and this with this one, with that one, here and here, this point, line here, and the other. Now, Oh, that this works. And that is uh, the, the box. After I finish the uh, first step, which is drawing the box, I dark uh, the box here and I erase uh, the line here, which is uh, we don't want. Now I will draw how uh, we choose the uh, point, which is a light source, and how it uh, reflects the shadow in the box. Start. Let's assume which is here. And here. And here. This is light source. And this is shadow vanishing point. That's light SVB, which is shadow vanishing point so uh, if we assume this is the right source <coughs> and this is the box 
And now we want to know where is the, the shadow will be. We uh, connect line between this point, uh, shadow vanishing point, with the with the here uh, with the point uh, the down of the box. See here. First point. Second point. Third point. And the right source here, the upper point, with the upper point and the box. So, first, second point, third point. Now, we have three points one here, one here, the other here. And also this point here and here. Now connect this three points with each other. Here the first, then with the box, and here the second point, and through the here. So here, this is will be the shadow of the this box. Here, try to draw the shadow of the box. And all this line, we didn't need it, so I will erase this line. So this is the final, uh, final drawings. As you can see, here the box, and here we choose this as a light source. And here will be the shadow. So this is other uh, drones. I change the the place of the red source and also the shadow vanishing boy. And I will now we will see where the shadow will be. Same steps in the last drones. Con uh, connect this. Uh, uh, shadow vanishing point with the, the with the down point of the box. This is the first point, second point, and inside of the box. Here, the third point, and our points of the of the box with the light source. Here, one. The second and the third, we ignore this uh, this line. So we have we have a uh, boy here. This is the first point. The first second point here, and the third point is this line with uh, this line. So will be here. So we have here and here. And here. This rest of the shadow. Now I will erase this, this line that we didn't, we didn't, uh, we don't need.
Uh, as you can see, this is the final uh, final drawings in the box. After we change the place of the light source and shadow vanishing point, here the here the box and here will be the shadow of the of the box. That's all. That is my video, and uh, thank you all for uh, for listening and for watching.